Hey guys, and welcome to Car Guy 1999 Reviews. Today, courtesy of Albrecht Autoland North in Nashua, New Hampshire, we have the 2020 Mustang GT Convertible Premium. Yes, this is the exact same spec as the EcoBoost I just drove, but with the 5 liter. So, this is a good comparison, and they're very, very similar miles too. Uh, both right around 50,000. Or just under, I should say. So, it's going to be a very good comparison to see what's new, what's different between the two of them. Any sticker? Do you see a sticker? Come on. Just not. Okay. Aim you down. So it should technically be off anyway. Alright, we'll be in Sport Plus. Hmm. Let's go for a drive. So, biggest difference sound. This one sounds good. Let's say an EcoBoost sounds bad. This just sounds like a Mustang should. And this isn't even the performance exhaust. This is just normal, everyday exhaust. Well, that's the wrong button. That's what I was supposed to see. Now, I have not floored this car, so I don't know what's going to happen in terms of grip. More than likely, I should roll into it, but... I saw that coming a mile away. Behave yourself. I will say, steering feels heavier in the GT. Probably the exact same steering rack. If not, I'll be mistaken. The steering is 100% heavier in the GT.
These sprinklers have been on for an hour. I will say, Mustang GT in the manual performance pack with the exhaust and all that is one of my favorite cars out there. Let's get it in orange fury, black interior. You got my name all over it. Alright you guys, thank you so much for watching, please like, share, subscribe, I'll see you all in the next one.